What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Plants vs. Zombies Heroes and there's a brand new food fight bundle for the food fight event going on right now. This particular bundle has uh, the event card Turkey Rider. If you get the mega bundle, you get the cornucopia as well as four of the Turkey Riders. I'm going to go and get that, but first we're going to take a look at what the Turkey Rider is all about. It's an imp. It's an imp pet, which is a really cool thing. Uh, when destroyed, it, you add a leftovers to your hand. So we're going to find out exactly how that works in both single player and multiplayer. Uh, in, in some uh, maybe ranked and casual matches. Uh, but we're for sure going to showcase it in single player and casual. Maybe we'll do ranked. Uh, this is the Turkey Rider. It's 2-2. Two, two. It costs two brains to play. And it's a hardy. So uh, when it's destroyed, you add a leftover to your hand. So what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy this. And then I'm going to uh, then go ahead and make a deck and showcase it. Uh, but furthermore, before we continue on with that, I do want to show you that uh, it looks like there's coming out with a new, a new plant as well. And uh, the new plant is down here. It is a smarty plant, and this uh, costs three. It's a two-three. It is the Mayflower, which is a really cool name because of the whole, you know, the whole Thanksgiving theme coming up. So the Mayflower right here is a flower plant. It's amphibious, which is cool. When this hurts the zombie hero, and you add a random corn, squash, or bean to your hand, might be cool for a bean deck. Uh, getting a random bean in you know due to the mayflower also having some more amphibious cover when you know you might not want to you know because the the this bean right here if you take a look at the the admiral navy bean has team up so could be a cool shield for for that of course we don't have this card yet this video will be focusing of course on uh what was it called again it was the hardy uh turkey rider so let's get that deck and let's showcase let's make a deck Let's get this card, make a deck, and showcase it in some gameplay. All right, I got the four pack, and of course, you know, I'm able to go ahead and spend money on this game thanks to your support. Thanks for every like and favorite on this on this episode, as well as the first episode with 1.8 million views, all thanks to you guys leaving over 22,000 likes. I'm sure the first episode will surpass 2 million views in no time. Well, this is much bigger than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> That's much. Wow, look at all these. Okay, so there we go. Yeah, we got a lot of cards coming at you. So let's open up... The, uh, the 12 pack, I guess. I didn't realize I thought it was going to be a 4 pack. But let's open up the 12 pack. Uh, I do want to take a screenshot of this, though, uh, if you don't mind. Boom, because I want to go ahead and, you know. Anyway, let's open this up. Let's see. It opens them all up, of course. So we're going to get a ton of plants that I don't even need because I already have them. And uh, so we're just kind of looking at what they're bringing in. And, you know, I do want to see what the leftovers thing is all about. So, uh, uh, let's see what happens. Come on, come on, come on in. Pour in, pour in. We can go faster than this, can't we? Of course, getting a lot of cards here. Did not need this many cards, to be real. But we got four of those amazing uh, turkeys. So, let's see. Come on, we're still going. There's a chicken. I didn't want a chicken. I want a turkey. Here we go. Got two, three, four of those. Uh, we got... Come on now. Come on. Okay. <laughs> All right, we get to see what this is all about. So this is what you can expect, something along these lines if you buy this. Uh, so there we go, we got two, three, four of these super rares right there. And then that's what we really wanted here. We got two, three, and four. Very cool. And we, we did, of course, get that one legendary, which I already have. I've already done a video showcasing this legendary. But sure, so we got him. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a deck with that. So there's gonna be, as soon as the Mayflower becomes available, I will do a video on that as well. So come back next time for that. But let's go ahead and now look at our collection. And uh, so yeah, we're gonna make a deck. Um, if we take a look, deck. Uh, so it's a hardy. And um, I'm trying to think what we wanna do. How do we wanna utilize this to the best? I mean, I can make a hardy deck like no other. Um, but uh, <laughs> was it hardy? Did I, make, did I miss it? Where is it? I thought it was Hardy. Is it not here? The Imp Chicken Rider? The pet? Where is it? Hold on. Let's look at it. Let's look at... What was it uh, left? Uh, maybe I missed, got confused. Oh, there. No, it's not Hardy. Why did I think it was Hardy? It is Hardy. Turkey Rider. Okay, so there he is. He's a turkey. Oh, probably because it was sorted in the new. That's right. I forgot now. That's how this game works. When you're, when you're looking, it sorts them all in the new. And I'm like, okay, I understand. It's in the new. I get it. But, uh, so yeah, it doesn't show up with the other ones yet. Not yet, at least. How do I just say, be done with it? I'm done looking at them. Okay. <laughs> trying to navigate this, this app here. Okay. So now they're under Hardy. Okay. Makes sense. That's how this game works. So there we go. Uh, we got the, um, there they are right there. And it's, of course, it's only cost two. It's a great deal. And when it dies, it adds a leftovers to your hand. So we're going to test that out. So I want to be sure, uh, to play it in single player. But first, I'm going to go ahead and make the deck. Hardy... I think this can go good with, um, you know, if we want to make sure he dies. 
Well, actually, let's do it. You know, this is Imp Pet Rider. We could really make a really cool deck with imps, I think. Or I can go for a pet deck. What do you think I should do? Pets or imps? I don't know. Um, just thinking to myself. Um, let's do a sneaky and a hardy, which would be black and orange. So new deck, uh, black and orange. Oh, a Neptuna deck. That sounds great. So let's go ahead and, uh, you know, we can do what we got to do here. Uh, I'm gonna bring in, of course, you know, a couple of these, a um, couple of these, a couple of these, a couple of these, a couple of these. <laughs> I'm gonna keep saying that over and over. Um, all right, I'm gonna bring in all four of these. I hope this is gonna be sufficient. I hope it is. Um, maybe this guy a couple times. This is gonna be a lot of cards. Um, I really don't know here. A couple of these guys. Just taking a look, you know. Um, be one of those. Did I get any of these? We're definitely doing a good job here, I think. I think we're gonna do a good job at least when it comes down to it. Um, We're doing a lot of, um, we're not doing very many tricks. So having those tricks, what is this again? Info, move a plant, draw a card. This is uh, info, start playing with two or less. Let's go ahead and move a plant, draw a card. Oh man, okay, it shouldn't let you add it. Okay, remove. So this is my, uh, what is this turkey guy called again? This is my deck where I showcase, um, where's the turkey guy? Where's he called? What is he called? What's he called? I keep forgetting his name. Um, it only costs two. Where the? Oh yeah, I put all four in my deck. Okay, there we go. The turkey guy is called Info Turkey Rider. So I'm gonna call this the Neptuna Turkey Rider deck. Neptuna uh, Turkey Rider. Great. Okay, so we're done. There it is, right there. And now we're gonna bring it into uh, the only single player thing I can do to test it out, which is in the zombie mission. Uh, peel that orange. All right, so, you know, this will allow us hopefully to get some practice with it before we actually go in and that way we'll, we're, we're guaranteed to see it in action. Because if I do just jump into casual matches or ranked matches, I may not even get one, but I got one right now. And this, I'm gonna cycle that out. Uh, cycle that out, it's kind of expensive. So let's go with this. I think this is going to be very, very valuable, and uh, we start with an extra brain, which is great, because I already get to, and also, I also get to see what Leftovers is all about, because I don't remember what Leftovers looks like, um, so here we go, we get extra brains, so when destroyed, gain a Leftover, so we'll see, he doesn't do anything other than that, but he's an imp pet, which is really useful, I think, because he can get deadly soon, uh, splash damage, so I am going to get hit, so watch out for that, um, okay. In a way, we kind of do want him destroyed, but in another way, we, we kind of don't. But uh, So we get extra brains, which is good. Let's see what we can do here. All right, so uh, I can tell you, uh, if I play this guy here, play this guy here. Excellent. And then play this guy here. I mean, the chicken just kind of there, just to be there, but... Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and take the damage. I want him to die so that I can see, you know, how he works. Okay, so it's still just one splash damage, right? Hopefully. Yeah, he's gone though. So I got a leftovers. There it is. So leftovers is something that I've never seen before. So I'm glad to see it. it's a turkey. All zombies get plus one, plus one. It's a gourmet trick. Okay, I can take that. I can deal with that. So I'm going to, uh, uh, you know, I have a trick phase, so I mean, specifically, it's going to be good for that. But uh, let's go ahead. I'm going to try to bounce this guy out, and then play this guy. Oh, I'm out of brains. Darn it. Okay. Well, leftovers. will I'll try to play it again next time. <laughs> okay. We're going to see who we're going to bounce, though. Team up. Okay. Ooh, all plants into pine clones, yikes. Who do I even want to bounce? 
I mean, I almost don't. Oh, man, he's going to be transformed, so I won't get another one of those. Ooh, plus three this turn. Does he get the plus three? Excellent. So who do I want to bounce? I mean, it's kind of uh, one of those things where I guess I, I, I guess I would want to protect my guy. So there we go. So unfortunate that I got transformed into something that can do four damage, but ooh, I blocked it. Good. Bounce, yeah, bounce another one. Get it out of here. He's going to have a lot of pine clones on his field now. There you go. Probably going to block the chicken, which means he won't be blocking this. There we go. All right, well, we got to see this in action, and uh, you know how that goes. I'm going to have pretty decent control over here of a lot of stuff. Uh, in fact, all I have are tricks, so let's see these tricks in action. He has so many cards, I can't even imagine. But uh, let's let's do imagine. <laughs> no. Okay, anyway. All right. Pine clone again. Gonna transform everyone into pine clones here. Is that what we're doing? No? Okay, so far not. But maybe he will. Oh, jeez. Oh, plants can't be hurt this turn. Well, you know what? That's fine with me. I have a couple of things to do. Uh, I'm going to play this. And uh, speak of not being hurt, they can still be bounced. So I'm going to bounce this guy out of here. And then I'm going to beef everyone up, give them plus one, plus one. Um, sure, that, that seems good enough. I might be able to win just on this, because I'll do four damage here. Can't hurt, but he won't die. Can't hurt, he will die. He won't die, but he can't hurt. Oh, no, he got some health. I forgot he got some health. Okay, never mind. That's fine. All right, I think having the strike throughout here is going to be really useful. The weak killer is destroy each plant with two or less. There's only, uh, two, well, there are two plants out there who qualify for that. This, uh, all plants get one, one, and Frenzy is going to be a killer. So, yeah, there you go. That's a good one. That's a good one right there. And then what happens next? Let's find out. I can take out two of them with the weak killer unless he gets... Oh, nope, nope, never mind. They're all pine clones. But, you know, I, I still have five in the amphibious section, so, you know. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. That's like almost all of them. Darn, man, that was very devastating. That was very devastating. So he might, you know, I don't know. I, this doesn't really work. Two or less. I mean, that's only going to kill one of them. Darn. Oh, well. Yeah, that's pretty pretty devastating. His zombie gets plus two in Frenzy, which will actually help me win this because <laughs> he's going to be able to survive. She's going to be able to survive. Look, she survived it, and now she attacks. That's a victory for me. Well, we got to see... But the turkey rider was able to pull off. But now we got to see the turkey rider in some sort, some form of a multiplayer. So I, I think that's going to be good. Hey, I continued part of... Uh, we completed part of a uh, Neptuna quest. So that's cool. All right. So, uh, yeah. Now we're going to have to take that deck. Uh, do I want to make any changes to that deck? Do I want to make any changes? I mean, it seems pretty good. Um, you know, having having a good variety, in my opinion, is is key. For how this works we do have uh we, we did we did get a lot more um i might go ahead and just remove one of these and then put in an extra one of these move a plant draw a card that might be good for me uh now let's do some multiplayer all right i decided to just go ahead and do ranked a ranked match uh let's see how it works out this one this guy's higher ranked than me but uh you know i i could get lucky now i gotta be mindful of what uh that's a good great start got to be mindful of what uh, the Green Shadow is capable of, which is an attack straight down the middle. Uh, but at the same time, you know, um, I'm going to go ahead and just start out with that. I mean, if she blocks it, she blocks it. If she doesn't, then, you know, that's fine. I, I prefer if she didn't block it. <laughs> but let's see. Yeah, okay. So, you know, we're going to cancel each other out there, which is fine. Hey, yeah. All right. So again, I will get a, uh, well, I think I'm gonna do this. Amphibious, it's a 3-1 in the Amphibious lane. Uh, that's gonna be a 3-1 this round. Oh, darn, freeze a zombie draw card. Darn, okay, that's fine. All right, so let's attack. 
He hit me for three items to do anything. Uh, I can play, though. Uh, this guy's deadly. I might just play this guy. Let's see what happens. If Green Shadow plays like a plant... Oh, man. Okay. Darn. A 6-2. That's, that's just really good. I thought maybe that she would play it there. All right. Got hit for one. Okay. There we go. Doing a lot of damage right now, which is lucky of me for sure. Um... I think I'm just gonna play the tricks, you know? The, just the old tricks. Actually, no. Uh, let's play... When destroyed, gain the leftovers. All right, so, but I, I still have tricks to rely on, so this is good. I'm anticipating that thing getting destroyed because I put it in the middle lane, so, you know, if she does a middle lane attack, Oh, great. All right, so I'm going to move this. It's going to get plus one, so it's a seven. I'm going to do ten damage, most likely. Let's bounce a plant. I hope it's the bonk choy. Oh, even better. I might win here, unless she blocks. Nice. Uh, I'm going to save this. Darn it, she blocked the seven, which is the worst. Okay, oh well. All plants get plus two. Drats. All right, so the seven was a good play. I could have won it there, but I didn't. Mm. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... man, this is tough. Uh, I could have bases loaded, basically going to block incoming damage, which I desperately need. I still have the trick of the amphibious in case, uh, you know, the she's able to take care of that. She's got to take care of the... I don't know what she's going to do. Draw two cards. That's a good one. Alright. Can't do much about that. Alright. Yep. I died. I died. Two damage coming up. I died. So it's nine to one. Very tough. Very tough to see how this is going to work. Um... This is a real problem, honestly. Uh, all right, I don't know. The rest are tricks, so I gotta be lucky. If I get one more hit, I'm good. But the rest are tricks, you know? Oh god, attacks here and next door. That's terrible. So if this attacks here next door, uh, then I have got to uh, really beef. I got to do it. I got to do all zombies get plus one, plus one. So there we go. Let's see it. Because I got to survive that. He got me. I got him. He got me. I got him. He got me. Uh, he got me a lot. But I survived and I won. Very cool. Ooh. What do you think about that, guys? There we go. That's a victory. And I got one star. Do I get one for winning the last one? Yes. Perfect. Very cool. So I got two points for that. I don't know if I got any sort of special thing or not, but I was able to, uh, you know. So as you see, that basically won the game for me. That, that card that I just got won the game for me. If we take a look at that deck, you know, that card, uh, it gave me the leftovers, which allowed me to beef up, uh, you, you know, the, the, the imp that was in the, the amphibious lane. It allowed that imp to survive and deal the final blow. So that card actually won the game for me. So that's really cool. Um, I cannot wait until I get the Mayflower because I really want to, I really want to make a bean deck with the May, Mayflower. You know, I have a lot of really good 
Uh, well, I don't know. You know, here's the thing. A lot of people now, now that the game's in worldwide release, you know, most of the games that I played um, were not you, when it was under worldwide release. It was under certain regions, so not many people had the game. Now that the game is in worldwide release, there are a lot of people who have great ideas for decks. There, there are Twitter accounts like dedicated to. I don't know it off the top of my head, but there are Twitter accounts dedicated to really awesome decks. And so what I'm going to do is after I showcase the Mayflower, I'm going to finish showcasing the legendaries because there, there were these legend. I was doing a showcase video on each legendary. I'm going to finish showcasing the legendaries, and then I'm going to try out different decks that people have made, and uh, and also ones that I've made, and just to see you know how well they do. And so I'm excited about the Mayflower, which will be my next episode. <laughs> Uh, as soon as I am able to purchase this, the Mayflower, because I really want to add it to my, my bean deck and see if it helps. And if you get a random corn, here's the thing. If you get a random corn, squash, or bean added to your hand, take a look at their corn options here. If you get a corn added to your hand, you got what? Either this guy or this guy? What else is it going to be? I mean, this guy's amazing, and this guy, they're both legendary. So if you get a corn added to your hand, they're both uh, uh, if it's if it, if it's working how I think it's working, you have a chance of getting a legendary added to your hand uh, when that hurts a zombie hero. I think. I'm not sure. This is just pure speculation. But as we end this episode, guys, uh, let's go ahead and read what this says because we didn't read it all the way. I just realized we didn't read it all the way when I saw that one. Uh, this once more, guys, was the turkey rider when destroyed at a leftovers uh, to your hand, in which we learned what leftovers was today. And here we go. He insists that, as far as modes of transportation go, turkeys outperform dolphins, walruses, and kangaroos any day. So, very cool. We didn't really get to see any Emperor Pet synergies going on uh, in this episode, but of course, you know, he has the imp abilities, he has the pet abilities, so super cool. Uh, if you take a look at just your imp, hold on, let me take a look at your, just the imps here. Um, you know, you have uh, you have all of these. This guy uh, is, is, uh, is a pirate gargantuar. Uh, is this guy an imp pet? Yeah, so that, that's another imp pet zombie. So now we have at least two imp pet zombies uh, that will work in both decks. Actually, this one's another imp pet. So we have three imp pet zombies that I know of that I can see right off the top of my head. So if you want to build, uh, you know, an imp and pet based deck, uh, then, you know, you have options. You have a new option in the hardy category. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Come back next time for more, and I'll see you then. Uh, for more Plants vs. Zombies Heroes. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thanks so much for watching. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. This is Otto, Egon, and I'll see you next time for more.